Charmers, Johnny here, and today I'm gonna be showing you how I did this look using the I Am Alma palette and the I Am Artista bundle from Tres Luz of Beauties. These two products are coming in our base box, so you Charmers are gonna be loving it this month, and I wanted to show you a quick tutorial and how these shadows perform because they're sickening. You're gonna love them. If you wanna see how I did this, just keep on watching. <laughs> I'm gonna get started with the I Am Alma palette that includes these six beautiful shades. As you can see, it has three mattes and three shimmers. I honestly am really, really excited to show you these shimmers because they are beautiful charmers. So I need to do a little swatch and show you. Look at this. These shimmers, they didn't came to play. When I'm telling you, especially this one right here, I'm obsessed. I love to No, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed. Put it under my brow. I've been using this palette for like three weeks now, four weeks. <laughs> Don't tell them. Don't tell Becky. Shh. But I love it. I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> First, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take this B100 brush from Tres Luces. And I'm going to take a little bit of the shade Bella, which is this brown, like a light brown shade. I'm only gonna use this to kind of like set my under eyes. As you can see, I don't have anything on it. And I'm just gonna press this all over my lid just to kind of like create like a depthness and some kind of shadow that I'm gonna then complement on top. The shade that I'm gonna go for today, it's gonna be a halo eye. So this is gonna be the perfect kind of transition shade for it. So the next shade that I'm gonna be using is this one right here, Alma, in the middle of the palette. As you can see, it's kind of like a deeper shade than Bella, and I'm only gonna use this on the outer and the inner part of my eye. Um, and for this, I'm using this special B102 brush from Tres Luce as well. I like the shape of this brush a lot because it's kind of like an angular brush. Usually I would use this to contour my nose, but it's also gonna be perfect to give me that like halo eye effect, as you can see. These shadows are super pigmented. <laughs> just one little tap like that and it did everything that I needed. I'm just gonna tap it out a little bit and then to blend it with that same brush, just using outward mo motions, just using outward motions in the, top of, in the top outer part of my eye, I'm just gonna blend this out. It's just super simple and I feel like this is just one of the easiest ways to create a halo eye, starting with like a base color on top and then complement it with the darker shade in the outer part. As you can see, all that I did is I, with the same brush and with the shade Alma, I blended all the way up to my brow and I also brought it a little bit under my eye just so you can like kind of connect the eye in the both areas. And now with a smaller brush, this is the Tresluce B121. I think the shade B, um, hold on. I don't know which one I'm gonna take. Okay. <laughs> it's because they're two pretty charmers. I don't know which one to choose. Divina is gorgeous and Grateful is also gorgeous. So I'm actually gonna use both, to be honest with you. Let's go. This is a tutorial. We're gonna go with it, charmers. First, I'm gonna take the, the shade Grateful, which is stunning. And again, this is one of those shimmery shades that you don't really need to do much of them. Let me show you what I mean. Mama, one more, one, I, like, I'm just gonna take one little bit more and then boop, 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 look, just a little tiny dab. Now let's just actually blend that all the way, wow. This is gorgeous. And this is really giving me exactly what I wanted, which is that halo eye effect. You see the two, sh uh, the two darker shades in the outer part and then this beautiful shimmery in the middle. And now to finish it up and complement this shimmer, I'm also gonna use the shade Divina, which I was dying to use as well. And I'm gonna apply this only under my inner corner and then on my brow bone. You're gonna see, it's kind of like very similar shimmers, but not the same. <laughs> Ooh, you see that frostiness that it gave me right there? I'm also gonna bring that a little bit up here. Oh my God, these shadows are so amazing charmers. Just to blend it out a little bit more, I'm gonna take that same brown, uh, th the same brush that I was using with the brown shades, Bella and Alma, and just gonna dab it on top to kind of like, you know, make sure that everything is seamless. I'm gonna go do the other eye off camera and I'll be right back, Charmers. <laughs> and the it, Charmers, tell me, let me know, 
what do you think about this gorgeous look? I am honestly loving, loving, loving these palettes from Tresluce Beauty. This palette, I was honestly, Charmers, really, really impressed about the quality of the shadows. As I showed you before, the shimmers, they look amazing in my hand when I swatch them, but also when I put them in my eyes. I am loving the results of this, and also the mattes, they're really, really pigmented. One more time, I would recommend this palette to anybody like these or the other Tresluce palette that we also have available in the box as well that some of you charmers are gonna be able to play with it. You charmers are gonna love it, honestly, honestly, honestly. And with that charmer, we end these mini tutorials. Please let us know what do you think about my look. If you're gonna be making it, please also tag us. I wanna see y'all recreating this look on our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, just tag us at Charm everywhere. Make sure you follow us on our social media that you're also liking this video down below and then you click that subscribe button down there, like right here. You see the little box? Hit it. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next Charmers. Bye. <laughs>